So distinguished guests, ladies and gentlemen, good morning and a good evening, Professor. So it is my great honor to welcome all of you participate in today's architecture dialogue. I would like to extend my sincere thanks and welcome to our guest owner, Ambassador Luis Casada, Vice President Yang Bing, and our Director Song Jianning, and Professor Eduardo Dajent. Thank you all for joining us to celebrate the 50th anniversary of establishment of diplomatic relations between China and Peru. As you know, geographically, China and Peru are separated by the wild Pacific Ocean. But for architectural researchers, there is a strong affinity between the two countries. Both two countries have extremely rich architecture heritage, and both countries are on the track of the rapid development, which brought huge transformations for contemporary architecture in cities. That is why we would like to organize this architecture dialogue. So to celebrate our long-term collaborations, we could learn from with each other wisdom and experience as we are facing similar challenges in many fields. Our school, as you know, signed cooperation agreements with the School of Architecture and Urbanism, PUCP, in 2011. Although the pandemic brought difficulties to face-to-face -face communication, our faculty member actually keep online discussion in recent years. Today's dialogue would be a great importance as leading scholars from both countries will share their thoughts and exchange ideas with all of us. I'm sure it will be a wonderful success and will further strengthen collaboration between the two institutions. Finally, I would like to thank you again for coming to our school and participating in this event. With strong faith, I believe that this architecture dialogue would add one more break to the building up of the strong tire between both of countries. Thanks indeed.